Hello, my name is John Ulmer. My role within Postal Transformation is Program and Design Lead for Material Handling, specifically containers and carts. With the new delivery model and motorization, we needed a new way to assist our letter carriers moving their sorted mail from the depot to their vehicles, so we had to design a new depot cart. In our design process, we looked at what other posts were doing around the world and selected the best practice and, and adapted them to meet the needs at Canada Post. I'm very proud to say that we've come up with a great prototype with lots of great features that make them easy and safe to use. I'm also pleased to report that I quote, new delivery cart is made up of 64% recycled material and more importantly is 95% recyclable at the end of its life. What you're about to see is a series of video clips that were taken at our supplier's location that demonstrate the testing, including the results, as well as the exciting features of the cart. We've designed the cart with all sorts of features that make it extremely easy to use by everyone. Here are some examples of this. The brake is very easy to use and can be engaged and disengaged using simple foot movements. A loaded cart can be maneuvered on a plant floor as well as in a parking lot. It's also very maneuverable on both paved and unpaved sections. For demonstration purposes, we loaded the cart with 150 kilos of softening salt. We placed the equivalent of 150 kilos of salt on the upper shelf and one bag on the lower platform where containers would normally be placed. By weighing the cart, we were able to show how easy it is to handle even when loaded to the maximum weight. An effort required to push the cart from a starting position as well as once in motion is within the force limit set by our ergonomic specialist. Test results clearly showed that the cart is easy to operate by one person, even when fully loaded including through snow from a local ski hill. And you'll actually see me pushing the cart while wearing dress shoes. We are trying to simulate the force that our letter carrier may have to use pushing the cart across a parking lot in winter. Having said that, we need to emphasize the use of proper footwear and anti-slip devices in winter conditions. You will also note that the snow does not gather in the casters, which could potentially freeze and cause problems. In operating the cart, we will place the containers on the lower section on the floor of the cart where there's specially made slots and place parcels on the upper shelf area of the cart. Since the cart will be used outdoors, we have holes in the lower panel for drainage. The cart has a unique shelf adjustment system that allows the shelf height to be adjusted by one hand. This shelf adjustment feature is to allow letter carriers of different heights to adjust the shelf to the height that best suits them. The three adjustment heights also allow additional container levels. Even someone who is very slight in stature can easily use the adjustable shelf to their advantage to make a small parcel at the back of the cart easy to reach. The delivery cart has plenty of safety features that make it very safe to use. One of our key design criteria was that the loaded cart should not tip on a 10 degree angle. Even when loaded, the cart withstands tipping at a little over 18 degrees, well beyond our target. Similarly, our design criteria for a stationary brake was to hold a loaded cart on a 10 degree angle. At the manufacturer, you can see the cart brake operate on a slope of about 5 degrees. For the actual test, we put the cart on a special trailer and tipped the trailer to 10 degrees to ensure that the brake would hold. Operating carts on a slope must be done with caution. One operator should not attempt to operate a loaded cart on a slope equal to or exceeding 10 degrees. The shelf was tested to hold 150 kilos of mail, which is significantly above our operating requirements. Although the shelf weighs 8.5 kilos, the lever action supports most of the weight and the shelf is easily adjusted with one hand. The lip on the cart platform and the shelf, along with the cargo netting, prevent contents from falling off a moving cart. The safe work practice is to have the webbing lying on the shelf at all times to ensure it does not touch the floor and become a tripping hazard. Once the letter carrier has adjusted the shelf to his or her comfortable height, then one side of the webbing can be attached, eliminating any possibility of the webbing touching the floor. Our handles are sized, colored, and positioned according to ergonomic best practices. A taller employee can grasp the handle near the top and a shorter employee near the bottom. You will note a cross member at the top of the cart this is for cart stability due to the open side. Although it's almost impossible to hit your head on this bar, we have wrapped it in foam just in case. We will be placing safe use instructions on all carts. <music>